every time. All right. I've got time. <laughs> got the clap. Good. It's uh, important. Yeah. Hello, and uh, welcome back to another episode of whatever. No, well, actually, actually, we have actually come up with the um, with the name for this. Um, now, before before you sort of, I'll, I'll let you say what the name is because right, it's been. Okay. It's we've we've thought long it's and hard about it. It's, it's, well, yeah. Um, I, I had a sort of an idea for for the name of the show, which was the Matt Bentley Show. Now, don't jump on there. That's not because I think of like I'm the best or whatever like that. Like just it's, in, in alphabetical order, then. No, no, not it's not. You are right, but it's not even yeah. that. Or oh. that it's like the Ricky Gervais Show. Like, do you know what I mean? I am similar to him, but it's not. <laughs> if anything, he wants to be more like me. I'm not, but it's it's because I'm younger. But no, um, of course, cool. better looking as well. I, I, I would say without a doubt. <laughs> Does it's not doesn't bad need now. to be said. Anyway, doesn't need to be said. The Matt Bentley show because when I was at school, a lot of teachers. I'm better looking than Stephen Merchant, though. Of course you are. Obviously, shorter too. Yeah, um, a lot. Of teachers... Which is a good thing because he's too tall, if anything. Yeah, but yeah. Oh, absolutely. And like, <laughs> no doubt. Yeah. We're not here to slag off Stephen Merchant. Let's... We're not. No, let's we'll get back on track. Let's come back to it. The, okay, um, go on. The sorry. Matt Bentley show, and I'll tell you why. It's because at school, a lot of teachers would go. Excuse me. So th- this isn't the Matt Bentley show. Oh, they like that's good actually. It is now. But. It quite it is. Well, it we're isn't. Not, we're not going to call it. We're not, we're not calling it. it. We're not but anyone call that is watching from school said that I'd be nothing. Um, look how wrong you are. Yeah, he's got his own show now. So, you haven't got your own show. <laughs> you haven't got your own show. Um, You're probably wondering why we had that gap. We had a bit of a gap, didn't we? In terms of, uh, and everyone's like, oh, was it? Are they doing we it? Got, in, I got it, a are lot. I got are we doing it in threes? Are we doing it like. I got loads of messages. What's the tap behind it? Didn't get around to it. Literally, yeah, yeah. I had other things on, and um, this isn't just. I what didn't. We do. I didn't have other things on. <laughs> just didn't do it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's true. You're just sitting at home. Yeah. Eating. I'm What's, we haven't even announced the name of the show yet. Oh, go yeah, go on. So um, we we put out a poll, had people vote in, um, and the result of that was. I don't know really because we don't really. We don't really pay attention to it. Yeah. But it has been suggested that um, there's, you know, there needs to be a focus for the show. And because of that, I think the name of the show is, is quite important. Um, so the show is The Lack of Focus Show with Harvey Quinn, myself, and... Your name Bentley. first. That's interesting. Well, <laughs> well, well, I just no, no. Your name. Your no, no. Whoever it's does not, the intro. It is. It is not. It is normally. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> show, like, Whoever does the intro, I wouldn't say with. But what would I say? So anyway, yeah. Lack of focus. Housekeeping. Um, like and subscribe. Apparently that's. Oh, yeah. For fuck's sake. Apparently that's that's what you have to say. Yeah. No, I'm not doing it there. We we'll just like and subscribe. Just like like it, obviously, and subscribe because you know you want to see more of it. In the and um, you'll get notifications that there that this is a, this is a thing that uh, that we're doing. Um, it is a show. It's a proper show. Oh, and it is a show. And these are episodes. Sorry, that is the catchphrase we always say. That's, we have to open. With Just that. to reiterate, we never edit this. We edit in funny bits, probably with like overlaying stuff. He does yeah. that. I, I mean, I tell. I, so I sort of I say what I'll be that. That's funny, and he'll yeah. go okay and do the computer bit. Yeah. I can't do anything. Underline it. Um, so and. Um, but we don't edit it. We we just let it. We just let it let it roll. Yeah. Um, we haven't got focus. We haven't got focus. I don't know what we're talking about. No. Literally, I, I like <laughs> right before we filmed. Right before we hit the film button. That's the technical term. I don't want to bog um, you down month, with all the yeah. with the semantics. Hit but. the film button. Yeah. Um, he said to me, "Don't know if any idea what we're going to talk about today." Uh, I don't either. So, opening gambit. How was your week? <sighs> it's been a couple of weeks. So how was your couple of weeks? Fine. All right. Boring, yeah. innit? But it's fine. No, it, look. Watch Goldeneye. Yeah, it's it's a great, that. great movie. Great movie. Great movie. It's, um, the only, now the only thing, is, it was on ITV3, yeah? It was. And um, the only thing with that, don't I, wanna, I, don't I, I just give them free promo. Oh, that's ITV, true. Do you know what I mean? That's true. Like they're, they're, I've been employed by ITV in the past. So you know what? You, in the edit, we'll bleep over that. You'll figure out how to do that. It's probably. Um, it's it's sort of like, and I'm going to say it a lot, so you're going to be quick. Yeah, um, yeah. It's ITV movies. It's ITV adverts with a with, with a bit of movie thrown in. Do you, do you notice that? It's so oh, there's, many, yeah. There's so many commercial breaks. So many commercial Welcome breaks. Welcome to America. Fuck. Have you ever watched TV in America? Yeah, it's a nightmare. I can't. It's chaos. No, it is Just, chaos. Like, there's no point. It's the reason why football is no uh, s- soccer for our American fans. <laughs> 
there are no American fans. Don't want you. Um, no, uh, I do. Wouldn't get it. It's the internet. We're oh, that's another thing I was going to say. Oh, I'm jumping off here. Go on. Um, uh, why football soccer has never taken off in America because they can't advertise. It's 45 minutes in their adverts. How fucking mad that is for like. But they could just. They could. They could just cut away. No, you can't. You, but they could. I'm saying they absolutely could. They but, could, but but they. they I mean, but but like if they did that, I presume I'm not a huge football f- person, right? No. You may you may be able to tell. Um, because you know I look too bulky, too. I've got too much mass. You are too top heavy to like for get football. get you know to the ball. Um, Adama Traore. You don't. Know I what don't that know means. what that means. I mean, everything about that bloke says he shouldn't be able to play football. Is he a big 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 man? Dude, he is fucking wedge. He's so like. He's so and rugby he, wedge. And he puts oil on himself so people can't like grip him. I swear, <laughs> literally. He's literally. not a Turkish oil wrestler. Right. He doesn't put oil on himself. He puts oil on himself. Huh? To stop people from gripping him. Yeah, and it works. Isn't that... He doesn't score many goals. But it's a non-contact sport. I'm not slagging off Adama Troy. He's a big boy. Like, I don't want to have anything, do you know what I mean? But, uh, it's not a contact sport. It is sort of a contact sport, though. But it... I played it very much like a contact sport. Although, if anyone ta- anyone tapped me, I'd... Go like, down. I'd just collapse. It's part of the game. It's, it's part, part of the game. It was definitely part of my game. <laughs> and the thing their is, game as And well. the thing is, if it, didn't, if it didn't get the free kick or the penalty, which it often did, um, it would just infuse... Because in, in lower league football, which mm. is, I'm not saying I played in the lowest of the leagues, I played in like sort of the middle middle leagues. Um, You're a mid, mid, mid-level player? Sure. Yeah. Um, Intermediate. People don't, don't go down easy. People don't do diving traditionally because it's more like a, yeah, kind of fucking hard nuts here. And I was like, I'm not. <laughs> I, you know, I'm quite quick. I've got a few All like tricks. All like white, like blue collar workers, Absol- and you're yeah. And then I, but the then whitest I, of colours. I, I, <laughs> and they would, I would, I would do sit, sort of diving a bit, yeah. And it would just rile them up. If I didn't get the free kick yeah. or a penalty, then the rest of the other team would just be furious. And a few members of my team who didn't know me that well, and I was, they would sort of get a bit embarrassed as well. But I got results. Got results. I, I imagine knowing you as well that if and you then were ever I saw- contested, yeah. you get hot. Oh, I got hot real quick. Oh, very, very fast. Most booked player. Most booked player in year eight, which is hard to do because they didn't really take cards to the games. I don't even remember what year eight. What, how old yeah, are you in year eight? really young. Like, like 12. 12, yeah. They didn't, they didn't normally have the cards at the game, so they'd just be like, you are on your final warning. I'm like, so is that a yellow card? They'd be like, yeah, yellow card. I'm like, you're booked, mate. Yeah. And then I, I got sent off once, but that's only because I retaliated someone else. He grabbed my neck for no, for no reason. That's definitely not in part. That's not in the official rules. No reason whatsoever. Um... So we were Golden talking, Eye, Golden Eye, Golden Eye, top movie. Golden Eye, top, very top movie. Top movie. Top movie. Um, what we were talking about, Pierce Brosnan, uh, who's the best Bond again? Just to reiterate, twenty five years of, of of Happy Gilmore. Oh yeah, that's the thing. That's huge. That's huge. Right, Adam Sandler, you can't miss. He can miss. He has missed many times. No, but he does on purpose. Like does he? J- J- Jack and Jill. Awful. By the way, Jack and Joe still got Al Pacino in it. He still it has does to... have Al Pacino in it. He, he, oh. oh, what's that? My activity ring's telling me to fucking it. Like, what to move? Yeah, you have to keep moving, otherwise you'll die. They're just like is that like a shark? That's why I use them. They don't tell me shit. It doesn't really <laughs> even tell me the time because I forget to wind it. You have to wind your own. No, I know. No. Yeah, that's a battery. Um, well, um, I know people that do have to wind their. I mean, no, Happy Gilmore. Top, top movie. Adam Sandler doesn't really miss and proved it with... Um, Jack and Jill. No, Jack and Jill and then came back with... Uh, if you haven't Boogie seen... Nights. If you haven't seen Click, by the way. Good movie. Cry, Cry I was Zell. talking about this the other day. Cry it's a Mar-Zell. really good movie. It's a great movie. Um, came back with um, Uncut Gems. Yep. And got but smart. it didn't really come back with that. He'd never really done anything like that before. I'd say Click is the closest thing to... Click is the closest thing to him actually doing acting of him being on set and being like... I, I care about this. I care about this. Do you not think Uncut Gems was that? I'm saying, yeah, Uncut Gems, he very much cared about he it. He very about much it. cared. Threw his toys out the pram a little bit when he didn't get a, oh, I didn't get an award. Well, yeah. listen, you haven't really given a fuck for 25 years. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like, you know, you when, can't just turn up. When Eddie Redmayne got um, got the Oscar, uh, wrongfully, by the way, for I don't think um, he's great. The Theory of Everything. Mm. He's very good in The Theory of Everything. He's great, great physical performance, but... Is it? The, he, it was, we, we can all do the, that. The same... <laughs> Same Physical year, performance. same year was the Imitation Game, which is a better movie. It is a better movie, and yeah, uh, it's a better movie. I just, I don't, listen, I don't want to be a dick, but I did say you're going to say something about Mark Strong, aren't you? No, 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 no. Oh. he's fantastic. Uh, wig, no wig, doesn't give a fuck. He nails it. Um, <laughs> no um, <laughs> wig, no wig. Who cares? I said a couple of weeks ago that uh, 
the best film of the of the tens was uh, the Social Network, and he did say that. Um, who was it? Who backed me up? Tarantino backed Quentin Tarantino. He doesn't, goes. He doesn't, He is correct as well. Yeah, not but, me. Not he didn't go. Matt Bentley, you're correct. He went. That is the best film of, the, of, of that ten years. So when I put this to you, is his when I put to you that the Imitation Game is also one of the best wartime movies mm. of all time, and I put that up there with Saving Private Ryan. Mm. I put it up there with Atonement, which is a wartime movie, and it it's is one of the movie. best. It is one of the best. For me, I, I just, it, I love for me, it depicts Dunkirk better than the film Dunkirk did. That's a, that's a bold shout. But it's, I, a, I, it's a huge statement. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's <laughs> you, no, okay, I want to go back to this because it's important. You said um, Social Network, yes, best movie of the um, of the of that decade. It is Tarantino backs you up, your yes. boy. Yeah. Um, you know his his filmmaking opinion. I I, I um I definitely take seriously. Anything else? Probably not. Tread Probably here. not. Tread um, you know what's so funny about Quentin Tarantino? Have you seen the photos for him doing he looks promo? Like crumpled Morrissey. Yeah, he was doing the promo photos for um, Once Upon a Time in in uh, in America. Mm. Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Hollywood. And you've got um, them them in, in in the in the Cadillac, and they're like leaning oh, back yeah, on yeah, this, yeah, 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 yeah. But looking up at the camera. Yeah. And there's a there's, you can tell the order they've taken the photos in because in one photo they're just like normal. The second photo, Brad Pitt does like is doing like a like a this thing, right? Mm. And then in the third photo, Quentin's gone. Man, it's fucking cool. I love that. <laughs> it does the same thing, and it just it you know like yeah. any any like half good looking decent geezer mm. doing trying to copy Brad Pitt. You're still you're still shit. You're still shit. Quentin, yeah. Qu- you've Tal- got other talents. Quentin, mate. Having an incredible face isn't one of those. He's got a good face, but not a. Uh, he's not Brad Pitt. He's not. He's not. Well, I don't. When I say good face, I mean interesting. If you're if like if you were a sculptor. <laughs> And you were like, oh, that's, he's interesting. He's got a certain <laughs> rock face type quality. Like the Incas, like... Um, Easter Island. Easter Island. He looks like a bit like an Easter Island head, yeah. yeah. Quentin, big chin, big brow. Yeah. Mm. Good Matt. caricature. He looks like a caricature of a human being. He really scares me, Quentin, around you know. He scares me as well. But he knows his movies and he backed me We'd up on that one. We'd so, love to work with him. We'd love to work with him. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Probably, like... Yeah, I'm not going to be turning that one down. Yeah. And I turn it down a lot. Yeah, like all everyone the goes, time. Matt. Why, why are you never working? And I'm like, it's because I'm turning stuff down. Because I don't get out of bed for less than three million dollars. Um, <clears throat> no, to go back to, yeah, you said your boy backed you up. Mm-hmm. Best movie of so the decade. The Imitation Game. So I would say that uh, 2014, by the way, was a yeah, great yeah, but- year for films. And I'll tell you why, and why why I know this so well was because I worked in a theatre at the time. I know. Imagine. I, do you know what I mean? Like, just like a regular guy, like sort of mad. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and, um, <laughs> fucking hell, I can't even get through it's that. Off the rails. That's awful. No, and uh, I had to sit and watch these movies over and over and over again. It was it was Birdman, which everyone slams. I, but I, I love lo- that movie. What the fuck is wrong with people? I love that movie. I, who slams Birdman? People. I was going to say. People. You people. You don't know, you, this is a problem with you. And you right? know what? They didn't get it. I didn't, you well, don't I didn't know get what it. you're watching. But they get it. What do you mean you didn't get it? Although the Brilliant. argument the argument to save cinema or anything really is that like if if you don't if you don't get it, then to you it's shit. Do you know what I mean? I don't yeah. like Do you know what, do you know what's funny? I watched um Lost in Translation in the cinema for the first time. I, I would have been young. Didn't get it. Can I can I, I remember sh- I remember leaving the cinema I mean like oh, shit. Can and I- then on a, then since I've grown up and become an actual human being you watch it again and it's fucking genius. Can I just shock you? You can shock me. You've never seen it. I have. Okay. I've, I've seen it. And you know when he's in the lift? You haven't seen fucking... You haven't seen Terminator 2 until you know, very recently. And you know, he's in the lift and he's got his whiskey. Right? So touring. I turned it off then. <laughs> <laughs> turned it off. Have you watched it since? Never gone back to it. So, okay. so And you know what? Sc- Scarlett Johansson, right? Mm. She's conned everybody. What do you mean? She's having it off. What do you mean she's having she's it off? She's having it off. What do you mean? Have you seen The Prestige? Yes. Have you heard her British accent in The Prestige? Yes. Yeah. At what point wasn't she embarrassed about that? Like, do you know what I mean? Like, well, she you... probably watched Keanu Reeves' British accent in Dracula. Have and you seen was his... like, it's fine. Have you seen him do Shakespeare? <laughs> yeah. Much ado about nothing. Do... <laughs> Kenneth Branagh casting him. And himself. <clears throat> yeah, but Kenneth Branagh... As much of a bell end as he I'm always sure puts he a is, hook in his I, mouth. As I'm sure he is, cast himself. Soul. Yeah. I, actually, no. I know someone who's who's worked with Kenneth Branagh, um, and I says, it, says he's a pretty safe. Nice I'm guy. sure. I'm sure he's a nice bloke. Yeah. But my point is, you said he seems too social... good at acting to be to be yeah. nice. He must he must be an arsehole because he's he's good. He's good. Yeah, he's good. See, I just brought that round in case you ever watched it. I like that. That's nice. Yeah. You can't pin me down. You can't. Here. 
You won't get me on the technical. Ken, 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 <laughs> Ken. Just back off, Ken. Look, have back a biscuit. Off, have a biscuit. Relax. Have a sit down. We'll get there. Let's all just calm we will down. get there. We've, no, all, we'll... we've all had a coffee. Exactly. Found my wheat bix. What morning. were you saying about? You were slagging oh. off um, Scarlett Johansson. I wasn't slagging her off. You I were was. slagging her off. <laughs> I, was, sorry, yeah. I think she's amazing. In Jojo Rabbit, it's not Jojo Rabbit. Oh, she's so Jojo good. Jojo Rabbit. In that. What is it? Jojo Rabbit. Not, is it Jojo Rabbit? Is it Jojo Rabbit? It's Jojo Rabbit. Yeah, and she's phenomenal. She's amazing in that. But I'm thinking of Jojo's Bizarre Adventure, which is a separate thing. <laughs> not gonna even. It's ask a very. That. It's very. Odd. Jojo she, Rabbit. She's, she's so what? good in that. I right? love that movie. But I'm saying in the Prestige. She's conned right. everyone. She's conned everyone. And she was a movie star by that point. It wasn't just like, who's this unknown? Who will give her a go? She was fucking Scarlett Johansson. It, like, I, you know, I, I, I don't know. I just feel yeah. like there, there were other there Also, were other Ke- Keanu, mate, we love you. No, don't, but you are terrible at <laughs> arguably acting. No, but, no, 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 no. Speed. The bus that couldn't slow down. It's a good concept for a movie. I, I just kicking myself. I didn't think of it. Yeah, I know. Um, no, we're talking about like so. The movie that you think is better than better than better than Birdman. Yes. Better than Parasite. Better than um, Three Billboards in Ebbing, Missouri. Better yes. than Parasite. Think what? Parasite came out in 2020, the 2010s. Oh, I'm not saying the Imitation Game is the best. Thing but you're saying of the Social the Network teams. is. Yes, it is. Parasite did not come out in the tens. It did. It came out in 2019. That's not the tens, mate. That's the teens. Oh yeah, you're right. I no, said, but when did when did Social Network come out? In 2010. Ah, crumbs. 10 to 20. You're right. Yeah. I am saying it's the best. I am. Yeah. Saying, I am yeah, saying, saying it's the that. Best. That's what you're saying. Because 2000 to 2009. And I back it up. Like, there's shit movie. What movies came out between 2000 and 2009? Uh, Layer Cake. Yeah. Uh, uh, the Fellowship of the Ring. The Return of the King. That's meant why to be everyone like... give, but everyone give us? It's the Twin Towers is the best one. The Twin Towers. Yeah, that's when Legolas goes down. On the, with the, no, on you, the surfboards no, and doing no, no, the no, fucking no, no. Bing, bing. No, no, no. the two towers the what? twin towers is is oh, is, 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 uh, is is I've is, always is, called it twin towers but they're not twins they're two they're two yeah two they're twins two one's an eye one's not even a fucking one's tower one's an eye and what's the other one the one with the, uh, with the Christopher Lee with, uh, his, yeah. with his nice voice like butter a new power is rising that's good it's not bad is it it's alright I'll see how it sounds back later Christopher Lee national treasure was a national treasure yeah, class. I gen- like R.I.P. Genuinely, he he, he was present at one of the last executions by guillotine trivia. He was in Paris. What the fuck? And witnessed it. Friends with Ian Fleming, arguably one of the sources of inspiration for Bond. He worked in Secret Service. Yes, I remember this. Younger. Yeah, but you uh, know, Ian Fleming was a fucking bum. I didn't know he was a bum. Yeah, he was man. A bum, he was a floundering bum. Until mm. he wrote Bond. I know that's a big thing. That's like saying, oh, he was a fucking bell end until he like wrote like the best thing ever. But he was. J.K. Rowling was a bum until she wrote. Oh, but she was. I mean, what? Yeah, she fucking. I mean, really. But that, but yeah, but why is that surprising that someone that was successful once had no, to struggle? No, no, no. J.K. Rowling struggled from day one, right? Now, she's had her own commentary, so let's not go down that road. But she struggled from day one and then wrote something amazing and then it blew up yeah. he was a mi- son to a millionaire multi-millionaire who drove around in the original Bond car which is what? what the DB5? no it's a, ben- it's a Bentley is it? yep the original one's a Bentley of course you'd know that of course i know that because I'm a narcissist no I, I watched I, I watch something on, on Ian Fleming when I couldn't sleep which is every night I'm <laughs> 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 sorry I had like two hours sleep last night it's all the time I know I left it's the heating the on I left the heating on it's all the time it was, I woke up sweltering yeah it's a good way to lose weight though what, fl- what, sweat it out? Christ, no. Don't, don't, don't take that advice. <laughs> yeah. Again, Seriously, again, no. again, don't take any advice. Yeah. Um, Prefix to that everything that we uh, say. Ian Fleming, yeah, Ian Fleming. He was, he was, um, he was an idiot. And everyone was just he like, he's an idiot. Yeah, yeah, seriously. Well, I can't, I'm not doing him justice, but watch this. <laughs> watch any documentary on Ian Fleming. He was a bellend who then just wrote Bond. And he's sort of like, but you're right, it was Christopher Lee who he based on Bond. Time, well, time's but a bit. Off. Time's going off. Which that's, one? That's 19 minutes. Oh, we've got a minute to wrap this up. So, Fuck. Um, and is that the whole thing finished? No, no, no. That's, that's first one half. first half. Oh, phew. I know. Fucking hell. I've got a lot more to say. I've got so much to say. And yeah, just, yeah. And yeah. Um, for those of you that are still here, um, yeah. a word from our sponsors. And look, and they were part of they, they they were behind the rebrand as well, the sponsors. Were they? Yeah, that's good. Yeah, they they you know they want more eyes on the show. Why wouldn't they? Because they makers. want more eyes on their product. They're money makers. Um, I know what they do. So yeah, a word from our uh, imaginary sponsors, which will which will make up in the next five minutes between <laughs> we change the tape. Absolutely, not yeah. tape. It's not like ninety five. Yeah.
walking back. Um. Oh, we were talking about murder. Were we? We were, we were talking about murder. Okay. Not previously. But we were talking about it. In the, on camera? Not on camera. Just Off camera. Oh. Offline. Offline. We were talking about murder because there was a man. Don't remember his name. It's not important. Uh, man killed... Years ago. Years ago. No, no. Years ago. Oh, years ago. <laughs> yeah. uh, I winked to camera. Years ago. I winked to camera. Don't wink to camera. Ah, oh, fucking hell. Oh! We're going to talk about Arrested Development as well. I just... Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, yeah. He wears yeah. an eye patch. He goes, you can't see, but I just winked at you. And that's the kind of, <laughs> It's just brilliant. Anyway. Yeah, he murdered... And he took... He took how He murdered his wife. He murdered his wife, right? He murdered his wife. This man. Uh... And then he like realized what he'd done and he called the police and um, he said, I've killed my wife, come and, come and arrest me, come and get me. And then- uh, His lawyer's tearing his hair out. His lawyer's like, you don't what confess you to, you like, do yeah, that. just say that it was an accident. You actually, she fell downstairs. That's the go-to, isn't it? That's a big one. Um, and big he one. got acquitted. He, they went to trial and the jury found him not guilty because Oh, he just, I flipped and he's suffering mental health issues and depression and apparently she told him to get over it and he just lost it and strangled her to death. Right, now now that, on in the face of it, sounds fine, right? Like, not fine, but like, oh yeah, he just, uh, it wasn't in his character and he just flipped. Yeah. But like, when strangling someone to death, apparently she had like broken bones in her neck. It's like, you'd have had so many opportunities to like, just to, to not. To stop doing to that. To stop doing that. Yeah. And then like, and then like, they're like, oh, it's, it, it was out of character for him. That's even more reason. You yeah. should be in jail. Yeah. Because you get out and you'd probably do it again to some poor woman. Or man. It's important to keep, or the, child. keep the topic light on yeah. this. Sort of like, that is, Ch- children murder. It's about as heavy as it gets. It's quite heavy, actually. It's about as heavy as it gets. It could get heavy. Bro- broken bones in her neck. Is, <laughs> that's, Don't say that sentence. That's bad. Again. Um, um, but then, to tie it back in, then, now this is going to be genius. You're going to appreciate this. I have no doubt. On a top from Goldeneye, she breaks a few necks, doesn't she? On With a her top. thighs. Uh, oh yeah, you've brought it right round yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. She is also she's thingy amazing. Grey, Jean Grey in X Men. In X Men. X Men. She um, is, and she's the uh, in, what in uh, longevity because she's not old in X Men. No, she's not. Do you know what I mean? Like she's like. Yeah. 20. She's, she's a babe, really. But like she, she looks, and uh, when I say she looks old in 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 Golden Knight, I mean that's like a woman. just like a woman. She, like she was just like she was like the ultimate woman. When it's I was like Cameron quite. Diaz in and the also, mask is a woman. You know what's so bad about like the oversexualization of like of of especially for our generation? Like I yeah. didn't consider Natalia in that movie fit at all until I watched it a couple of years ago, and I was like, oh my god, on a top. Natalia on a top. No, Nat- Natalia. Natalia. My, my name is oh, Natalia. Oh, oh, Eli- Eli- Isabella Scorpio. Whatever. That's her real name. That's <laughs> sick. You should just give her that name. Yeah, no, just call her that. <laughs> Fucking hell. No, she'd be She's a amazing. Dick. Spoiler, if you haven't seen Goldeneye, grow up. But spoiler, yeah. she is the good guy and... Alan Cumming. Whatever. Boris. No. no, I'm saying she's the good girl. There's always the good a bond. Girl. There's, There's always two. a good girl There's... and a bad girl. Yeah, yeah that's And you have, weird, to, you have to use your cunning to guess which one's the good one or bad one. Early doors. That one is fucking obvious. She strangles people with her legs. Yeah. During sex, that doesn't really make any sense. Oh, I know. When but he's around, around the waist, when he when he when he's in the steam oh, in, in the it? in the steam room, what did he? He says like a funny line, "Cool off" or something. Like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, no, doesn't it? Doesn't he? Doesn't he throw the towel? And goes no, 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 no. plays over. Yeah, <laughs> sick Pierce. Oh, Pierce God. Brosnan. There's so many good lines he's got. Um. Uh, speaking of people who I really, oh, I just can't stand. Who's that? Um, who's that Welsh actor who's brilliant at everything? Who plays um, Tony Blair quite a lot? Oh, fucking uh, Martin Sheen, Michael yes. Sheen, Martin Sheen. So he, I, what he was doing a. He's st- amazing. Whatever. He's amazing. Sure, and he was doing this thing. Um, <laughs> When he was talking about how he can't be Bond, and I was like, "Correct, so, for so many you reasons." Can't, you can't be Bond. And he was like, "No, no, I wasn't." This wasn't a conversation I was having with him, by the way. He was having a conversation with someone else, but I always. You were yelling at the TV. <laughs> yeah, 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 Dorito that. crumbs spilling <laughs> from your mouth. Because <laughs> <laughs> that's what I was doing. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was doing last night. Actually, actually he said, similar. "What's it?" Um, and he was like, "I can't be Bond because I was in a Bond film." And if you're ever in a Bond film, you can't be Bond. How is mad he, is that? Who's he in a Bond film? He, his scene was cut. That was really harsh. But well, then he's not in a Bond film. Well, he, he, he was, apparently. But and he's was, not. His scene it, is cut. 
and they said, they said oh, I'm in I'm in I'm in Jurassic Park but my scene was cut <laughs> I mean, like, all of the movies you've seen and like, I'm, I was in. I was I'm in them. one of the leads of Greed, but most of my scenes were cut. Yeah. Most of my scenes yeah. were cut. Yeah. I, so, did, I, I did this thing, because they improvised a lot on that set. I, I was sort of shoehorn my way into like every, every scene. Like, if, like if it was like a close scene on A-side, I'd be like, oh, spit, spit that for me. And they'd be like, can you fuck off? Yeah, can you get the fuck out of here? <laughs> Who is this guy? And they were like, he plays Steve Coogan's other son. Well... Is that necessary? Yeah, because of the lawsuits. Oh, for f- oh. Get him out of here. Um, anyway, Martin Sheen can't be Bond because of that reason. Oh. Um, and, so I um, can't ever be... Um, I can't even be Bond either because, you know... You are a bit Asian for Bond. Too Asian for Bond. Or maybe that's because that- of the way it's going. It might be the perfect hybrid. You know what I mean? Asian Bond. Well... Because they're trying to diversify Bond, obviously. I don't look Asian enough, though, do I? No. We've talked about it. If this. I'm being honest, you are taking the piss by saying it. <laughs> like, well, I, am, I, am, I am. No, I, am. I know. I get it. Yeah. Like, you're you're an Asian man. Yeah. Biologically speaking. Biologically, but, but I, I it's I'll be bollocks. honest. I don't think I've seen. Think this is an interesting discussion to have, right? Because okay. I've I've not ever like, no one's ever um, like. Other than like school kids who knew, like who'd seen my dad, and then then to be racist, you know, sure. like little kids, yeah. how they are. Christ. But I've never really experienced like, like full on, like like no, racism, to, uh, because I just I, I can I can pass off as like Italian or like English or whatever. I don't look I look European. Yeah. But I have had like people be racist towards Asian people in front of me and not know. Yeah, that's and heavy. then then that's that's I'm heavy. like, ooh. Guys, like, like, and then I'll say, and then they'll be, but you're not. And that, in a way, is oh, almost that's racist. Also, that's as yeah. bad. That's as yeah. bad. And, and, and I've had people be like, no, you're not Asian. It's like, well, like, no, I am. Yeah. It's like um, Ross Barkley. The, the, I know this means nothing to you, but some of our viewers will know this. Ross Barkley, the footballer, um, yeah. is, is eligible to play for Nigeria. He is mixed race, but he just, he literally looks like he, as, he looks Caucasian Caucasian. As, as anyone else. But I can imagine... That's, I mean, that's one, two people that I know yeah. of but immediately. I think, I think, I think there are people re- who are re- being re- racist around yeah. people who are thinking like, yeah, you're another joke, mate. Like, yeah. the fuck? It, dude, you? the reality is in a few hundred years, it's going to be completely irrelevant because I think we'll all kind of have, we'll all have kind of a mixed race heritage. I love how you just always jump to like... A couple hundred bigger. years. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you're right. Yeah. You are right. Yeah. Um, I think with teething problems, isn't it? <laughs> it's like uh, that, the, the Iggy Thump lyric... Hey America, why don't you kick yourself out? You're all immigrants too. I love that. Because they fucking are. Well, yeah, yeah. Apart from the ones that aren't. The, Na- the First Na- Nations. The Native though, Americans. Yeah. yeah. Yes. I think they want to be called First Nations. And like, Colu- was it Columbus? Christopher Columbus? Bastard. Rapist. Is he? Of course, he went into the... He, he, he like, like scab... He's, yeah, he's a scumbag. Yeah. And that's why, like, you should Horrible. really, really do... Like, th- this is the whole thing of, like, I'm seeing it a lot more... Especially with the with the Black Lives Matter movement of like educating or whatever, going mm. back and learning history that isn't in just um, just the textbooks that you yeah. were written by. I think white I think our, I think our, our, yeah, our history is because Christopher super Columbus selective. was a fucking monster. Theor- yeah, you must yeah, have been. yeah. I mean, any th- any sort of invading right uh, army, <laughs> yes, is not going to be great. No, um, they didn't just like hand over a turkey and been like, on your way, guys. Yeah. See you next time. I've, got I've definitely hat. seen a cartoon of that happening there. Absolutely, I've seen a hat, of, uh, a hat of that, a cartoon of that. I've seen a hat of that. Um, I've not seen a hat of that. But yeah, um, so I can't really be. I probably can't be Bond right now. But no, know. no. Would you want to be Bond? Yeah. Everyone's always like Tom Hardy. He's is he going to be the next Bond? He doesn't want to be Bond. I think Fastbender would be a great Bond. I think, and I don't like saying it, but I do think that um, who's Loki? What's his name? Tom Hiddleston. I think Tom Hiddleston would be a good Bond. He would be, yeah. He's, he's quite he, cold enough, isn't he? Yeah, I, I, look, he's like that kind of... I reckon if you... This is going to sound weird. I reckon, if you, I reckon if he was your friend, you'd really like him. <laughs> he's just so unlikable as a stranger. It's mad. It's because he's... Uh, and he like he thinks he's so hot and so good looking. And he has he's a, pretty good looking. Oh, I know he's... And he is, I know. But like, don't... And he does that thing when he goes on like BBC Radio 1 or whatever. And he's like, they're like, oh my God, Tom, can you use your like really silky voice to read out the thing? And people's like, oh, drawling over it. And he's like... Hello, this is Tom Hiddleston, and I'm going to be talking about. It. And he's like, he knows how. I'm like, you fucking bell ends. Like, just I know what you mean. Be like, who's like Ryan Gosling? 
the ultimate good looking bloke. Yeah. Who of, is aware he's really good looking. Yeah, and a bit of a neek. <laughs> and just leaves it alone. Just yeah, he's like a bit of a like, Anyway, Tom Hardy doesn't want to be with Bond. I love too much I of love a commitment. Like, uh, I love Ryan Gosling. Um, and I think he's sort of. Who would be. I think, I think Clive Owen would have made a good Bond b- if, when he had, was a thousand years old now. Yeah. Had they kept going down that, that cycle with the Bonds after Pierce Brosnan. Mm. He was an obvious, an obvious choice. Pierce Brosnan's so sick. Pierce Brosnan was the best. <laughs> what a hero! It's, it's difficult to get better oh, than him. It's, it's, you can't get better than him. I watch him in anything. I watch. I watch Pierce he... Brosnan in anything. Have you seen Taffin? No, I, I, you know what? I say that, and actually, I wouldn't watch him in anything. I've seen him in Mrs. Doubtfire. <laughs> he's good in that. I turned off Dante's piece. He's in, in Mrs. Doubtfire. He's a good dude. Yeah. He's like, oh, he, he yeah, no, he, how, he, how he gets, invo- he gets involved with a, a woman who has kids, and he's like, I, I love know. those kids. I know. I, I love know. them. I want them. Like, and oh no, we hate him because Robin Williams, Williams is such a G. He's an out and out bad guy in that movie. There's no yeah. doubt about it. What but, he's but doing is that's the ge- that's the genius weird. of Robin Williams. Yeah, he makes that likable. Yeah. Anyone else? Like, I don't think they'd get away with it. Like he he's like this wife is. You're being so unreasonable. There's animals <laughs> all over our house. <laughs> yeah. Like my wife. What are you doing? You're so boring. I'm just trying to have fun with our kids. Yeah, Robin, get it together, man. Yeah. Like what are you well, doing? You got to pay the bills, You're Robin. Buff. Like you, you've really got to rein it in here, Robin. You just got fired, mate. <laughs> you, you, you just got fired you're, from you're your s- animating job. You're, you're the breadwinner. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like what, there's animals everywhere. And yeah. so, so and you got fired. And you thought you, you thought spending yeah. loads of money on an yeah. animal farm was a good idea. Madness. Get it together, mate. <laughs> Wake up. You're gonna, you're gonna lose your kids, Robin. <laughs> <laughs> and he does. He and he does. Yeah, and Pierce gets sniffing around. Of course he does. Of, of course, Pierce Brosnan's is there. That is a and warning. He smashes up his Mercedes. <laughs> yeah, no. Buy Mercedes Benz products. But, sorry, I gotta get that plug in. Oh yeah, yeah, that's a good thing. <clears throat> Don't smash them. Don't. Buy any product you can buy Mercedes. They're a great company. They're a great do company a lot for the in the environment. Yeah, they, they they do with the EQC range. The EQ range is very good. Yeah. So I didn't. I oh I did the uh, the uh, AVTR. Yeah, AVTR. But that's not. You can't buy that. So don't can't try. buy that. Can't even drive it. Can't drive it. Um, um, well, the experts can drive it. They wouldn't let me drive yeah, it. Yeah. They really got very. They got. They're quite irate. They got actually. aggy. Yeah. 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 Um, they had to like some have someone come over with like a rag and like hand polish it and then me too. he looked at me with grave concern when I said can I sit in it <laughs> and he was like well we- yeah. oh yeah, and then no. he just and then he just walked off yeah and had there were like heated discussions in German <laughs> and I was just sort of standing there like a lemon you don't speak German yet? no no That's no a few words oh, I, I, I don't even have a few words it's they, they all have they're all very good in English they're very good at English yeah um, um uh, Pierce Brosnan what are the bad guys? That's an interesting topic and a funny one of when movies just out and out just make the bad, the, the, the good, your hero, what he's doing is like awful yeah. things. Yeah. The Karate Kid, I've never seen the Karate Kid. What? I, I've Cobra seen, Kai is I've, really good. I've seen the argument for saying that the, the Karate Kid got, who, what, what film, what show do they do that in? They make a really big deal of it. Cobra Kai. No, 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 no. It's, um. Cobra Kai is, an, is a show. It's really good. It's stop fake. saying Cobra Kai. I want to. I, I want to stop saying Cobra Kai. Yeah, I don't understand. But it. we've not discussed it yet. And they, and it's the idea that he's the uh, he's the bad guy, and the and the guys in the skeleton Daniel outfits Sam. are the good guys, and the karate kids actually they're the dickhead because he like throws he comes comes over. I know this first scene that and he's like he throws sand on him. He has a fight very similar to the OC season one. Ooh, um, I love the OC season one. What's not to love? What's not to love about that show? Um, what's not to love about it? No, don't no, don't actually. Oh, okay, well let's yeah, let's leave it there. Something to just this was going to mess people up. What I want to tell you is going to mess you up. Go on. Ryan's pool house, right in that show. Mm. You know he's coming out and he's like, oh, yes, that's indoors. That's an indoor set, and the pool is about that thick, thick, <laughs> deep. Yeah. Blew my mind. Well, don't just it's a real ruin shame. all of my childhood. It's a real shame. That's a shame. Yeah, that's a real shame. Why'd you, how'd you know this? Uh, I really, really wanted to be in that show. And through my... I actually... I failed a, <laughs> it was I failed a, very, a lot very long of my, letter campaign. <laughs> I failed a lot of my exams because I was walking around... Uh, Humming that track. Northwest London, pretending in my head, I'm a mad person, that I was, that I was just sort of 
a mix between Ryan and, and, and Seth, just sort of going about my life, getting into you know, shenanigans. That's the timer, by the way. Oh, we're on top of it this time. I will Ooh. not. We're not going to just cut out. Well, look, it's fifteen, which let's... means we've got five to wrap up. Let's wrap up. So if you have got this far, it's over soon. So you've done well. Again, done I really think well. the focal point of a show, yes, is a good thing. Yes, we've got a bit more direction. Um, we have a title. We, we had title. a t- we had a title before. Was it lack of focus? No, that's our title now. What was the title before? Uh, I always, we don't really know what to call we this. We don't really know what to call this. But uh, lack of focus, much better. Gives you it tells you what all you need to know about the show. Yeah. Well, not all you need to. You should probably watch it end to end. What go back and watch the other ones? Because um, it's you know it's important stuff. Um, Hard hitting social commentary, really. Um, Some of it is. I don't know what we've. All of it. Is. I've already forgotten. No, all of it is. You've forgotten what? What, we, what we've spoken about today. Apparently, Noth- what a lot of a lot. people do. I say a lot of people. The handful of people who are who are tuning into this is that we're sort of just on. People are just doing it. We're just on in the backgrounds, and they're just sort of around the whatever. Mm. Um, yeah. Well, don't. I mean, look. The, you, ch- you can choose to watch this however you like, but I, I would. I would pay. Work. I would pay attention. Um, Pay attention because there will be there will yeah. be a quiz. Because the, the, the reality is, uh, when 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 I see you, and I will, I'm going to be asking you questions. Yeah. Um, In fact, the next time, so the next time someone goes, oh man, I, I, I like the podcast. I'm which like, one? Which bit? Which bits ex- explicitly? Which bit do you like? And if you can't answer, and I'll know which bit is good and which bit's bad. I will, Trust me, it, I know. Look, which yeah, bits and if if you can't answer, bad. I'm. I'm I don't know. I'll probably give you a Chinese burn. And that's not racist. I've checked. That's not racist. Okay. Chinese but I mean, just, you okay. know. The- I, I understand what you mean. Yeah. I think it is racist, mate. Is it? I think so. You can't say Chinese burn anymore. I wouldn't think so. I really wouldn't. Anything that has... What would you call it then? Wrist twister. <laughs> I quite like that, but it's not wrist. It's more... That's your wrist? Forearm. 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 Big wrist. Forearm burner. Forearm. Forearm burner. Forearm. Look, it doesn't roll off the tongue as much, but I'm, no, it's not. I, Chinese I, I, burn. I, ju- I, ju- I, I, re- I really don't think you can be saying Chinese burn, mate. Okay, well, look, you answer this question for us. Write in, leave a comment below about Chinese burns. <clears throat> don't think. Forearm. I can stop saying it. Don't. Stop saying it. I don't leave comments below about that either. Some comments would, below would be nice. Yeah, just, you know, suggest things. Suggest, you know, anything we can. Do you know what? I, I, I won't read it. Um. Do you want to wrap this up? Yeah. Go on. You're better at wrapping up. No, because I, I, just, I just tell people to fuck off and then that's it. <laughs> um, I, I'm going somewhere with this, don't worry. Just wait. Just wait. I mean, fuck, this is dead air. No, no, it's not dead air. It's not dead air. <laughs> dead air! It's not dead air. I'm just... Uh... I should let it play out. No, because... No, because that's... Definitely not. Definitely not. This is a bit of a banger, to be fair. Yeah, but we've got to have... We've got to, we can't, Also, we're going to oh. get demonetised. Ah. We're not demonetised. Ah. We're going to get kicked off. Okay, this is... Yeah, you yeah. wrap up. I'll wrap up. I often just walk away like this. Yeah, do that. I'll sort it out. And you sort of just sort of... Um...